Welcome to Sandstorm. These are our studios on the edge of the Cotswolds. Let me show you around. The M4 Junction 15 is just over there. This is our cafe and we often serve our lunches from the barbecue and the pizza oven. Come on in. Start the day with barista coffee and finish it with a glass of beer or wine. On non-shoot days, it's actually open to the public, so come on over, or you can hire it exclusively for your production. Luz, makeup and green room, and this is the largest stage at Sandstorm. This is Studio 3. It's 5,600 square foot. It's a sound stage. It's got overhead rigging, scissor lifts, winches, on-site set build. You can even hire our techno dolly with it, which has over 60 foot of track. We've got cameras, lenses, lights, audio kit, even auto cue, which you can hire individually or as part of a package deal. Whether you're here just hiring a studio or we're looking after the whole production for you, we can find a way to make it work. So, let me show you something extra special for you, your crew and your clients. The director lounge. On non-shoot days, ideal for lunches, meetings, small events. And on shoot days, it's very common to have all the talent up here. And in the winter, we also have the open fire on too. The most popular meeting room at Sandstorm, the West View, where your client can sit, watch a feed from the studio with lightning fast Wi-Fi and the best place to appreciate that. Ideally with a glass of wine, toasting a successful shoot. Now, let me show you the chair on the top. Let's go upstairs. And this is the therapy floor with sauna, showers, changing rooms and massage therapy. Shoots are renowned for being very long days, pretty stressful. Well, I can't say we've managed to make the days a lot shorter, but we've certainly made them an awful lot less stressful. Right, let me show you the other building. We've got over 50 car parking spaces here, as well as a fleet of vehicles for all your location needs, including a minibus for those all too common train station and hotel shuttle runs. The building in front of us is a converted cow shed, which is now our reception, two sound stages, workshops and post-production. So first, let's look at post-production. Edit suites, backup, FTP, shared storage, audio mix and voiceover and grading. If you're here on a shoot, you can use this for Q-Take, DIT, or do what most people do and go the whole hog and use this for all your post-production and delivery. Let me show you Studio One with makeup, kitchen, and shower rooms. This is still the most popular studio. It's acoustically treated, fully air-conditioned with dual infinity cove. It's perfect for photography, car shoots, and small set builds. It's 1,360 square foot, and it's got a roller shutter door. This is Studio 2, it's the smallest studio here at Sandstorm, it's 970 square foot. Perfect for chroma key, high speed work and special effects. The floor is made from concrete and the walls and ceiling are fire retardant, so you can make a real mess in here. It's not uncommon for people to hire this room and Studio 1 together and maybe use this for wardrobe and props. This is our lounge where you can sit by the fire, watch a feed from any of the studios on site and when the weather's kind, which is today, you can sit out in the garden too. Oh, before I forget, the best bit of the post-production department, in my opinion anyway, the cinema. This is where we mix our Dolby approved sound, record voiceover, and the best place to watch your final masterpiece. We're under 40 minutes from Bristol and under an hour from Heathrow, and in 2023, we'll have accommodation on site to complete the experience. Well, and I'm hopeful of pool there too. So, that's Sandstorm.